it's kind of winter so I'm wearing like winter clothes right now I'm going to this place called Barking Creek to get the dog some food my assistant really likes it so we're gonna give it a shot <sighs> lamb and rice chicken and rice chicken noodle fish and chips beef potato I think we're gonna do this one bag secured that fellow was lovely I really liked him I would love love to work at a dog place where I got to see cute dogs getting groomed all day but anyways I gotta go this is cold and I'm cold and I want to go inside I have some shrimp some steak half a cup of rice and then I'm cooking some rice cauliflower in the microwave to defrost it so that it doesn't make this all too watery and I'm going to saute this after I finish sauteing up my mushrooms. These are just enoki mushrooms with some nutritional yeast and the Kinder's red garlic seasoning. Okay, this is my rice cauliflower stir fry. It has half cup of rice and then the bag of rice cauliflower, the um, fried rice style. And then you saw everything I put in. I just put a little bit of chili onion crunch on top and just a drizzle of this uh, G Hughes. It doesn't want to focus on it because I pointed somewhere else. And then I just have some enoki mushrooms on the side. Last night I did uh, Chinese broccoli on the side, but I want enoki mushrooms tonight. It just has nutritional yeast and um, red garlic on it and a little bit of avocado oil and then a chicken egg roll so a lot to my dinner i got this uh collagen plus electrolytes from ultima i actually thought this order didn't exist because i did not get a confirmation <laughs> and i was looking and i was like mm, what card did i put this on because i don't see that i paid for it either <laughs> So, clearly I did because it's here and I thought it was PayPal because I usually use PayPal. I don't know how it happened, but they're here. I got both flavors. These are the only ones they have. And apparently they only do this like limited. They don't do it like year round. They just bring them out. I am, as we know, allergic to pineapple, but I think it will be fine. And my mom's over there posing. Uh, she wants to be a vlogger, like, secretly, guys. <laughs> she pretends she doesn't want to be on camera, but she's where I get all my charisma from. Mm, I don't know. My dad was pretty charismatic, too. But anyhow, Ultima. I'm going to try them. I'll probably try one tonight and let you guys know in the morning when I try the other one how they were. Good morning. I have the kitchen a disaster right now. I have, I'm getting ready to fill my water bottle. I'm going to use that um, collagen I got last night my water bottle my Stanley I have oh my gosh I don't know where my hand is I'm looking in the camera not around cup coffee cup I'm getting ready to make coffee I have bacon and eggs out and cottage cheese for breakfast and I have my stuff back there because I'm getting ready to make my lunch so a lot going on here this morning and say it with me kids I'm running late yes yeah, so um Good thing I'm the director of my own department. I can do what I want because otherwise I would be late all the time. People with ADHD get a job where your schedule's flexible because otherwise, no, not good. All right, I'm gonna start. I feel like we need to start with coffee. So I'm gonna do the pumpkin spice with the pumpkin spice collagen. I actually need these over here with the lunch stuff because this is all for lunch that I'm making today. This is my little coffee corner at the moment. Um, my mom hates the smell of coffee, so. Oh my gosh, I did bad. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> I just accidentally opened it. Okay, yeah, it's this one. Okay. Right. There we go. Um, I am doing just a pumpkin spice and then I'm gonna add some of this 
one in and then a little bit of creamer that should be good and then I'm gonna also gonna have this collagen so we're having like a lot of collagen today but I feel like I need backlog <laughs> of collagen at the moment hi me right there glad I have on clothes you know my old tattered robe I did order a new robe because some of you guys were roasting my robe because it has like this hole in it and then the it doesn't really tie very well anymore <laughs> the beauty collagen um, from Ultima actually does dissolve very well last night I put it straight into my cup and it didn't dissolve quite as well but if you can agitate it it does dissolve so I'm gonna add another bottle of water and ice into my Stanley so it'll be diluted it won't be like I guess drink how it's intended but it's fine here's my coffee uh, the crema melted because I put in my collagen so yeah I only do half the serving of collagen because otherwise it's too sweet once I add my creamer so I do like half the suggested so those will last me twice as long as they're supposed to I want my wrap to be kind of Italian-y like a grinder or something so I'm gonna use some of the Olive Garden dressing I just have these tiny little containers I actually don't have these um, I'm stealing this from my mother <laughs> she doesn't take her lunch anywhere anymore so it's just this little thing and then I'm just gonna do my normal like turkey I'll show you so here's what we're working with. I have my turkey and cheese and dressing. And then I have pickled okra. That's just for the side. And then I put the pepperoncinis on there. This looks like it's all lettuce, but there's tomato at the bottom. This is my Olay wrap. And I wrap it in a paper towel just so I have something to wipe my hands with. And just in case the turkey starts to, like, be moist. It doesn't really, but sometimes it'll make the wrap soggy. So I just put that on there to kind of avoid that. And then I can pack it up. Um, let's see if I can do it with one hand. I tried putting my chips in here and like everything in one earlier, but then I didn't get the full serving of chips, which I wanted, and um, it just didn't work out quite as well because then the lettuce got too soggy from the pickled stuff. So this has been what's working. And then I have the lid. I got to put the spoon and fork back in here. Um, sometimes I use it. Not always, but... I like to have it just in case I got this from TikTok shop I will link it it was literally like three dollars and I love it um, then I have my chips serving of chips and a yogurt for a snack and I have some kiwis in my fridge at work so I'll have like a fruit and a yogurt before I go to cheer practice and that's my lunch my quick breakfast it's 9 53 i'm supposed to leave at 10 and i haven't even done my makeup yet so that's how my morning's going but i am going to sit down and eat breakfast regardless <laughs> so i just did um it's three medium eggs um and i scrambled them with cottage cheese because i didn't feel like eating the cottage cheese separate today because i want a warm breakfast sourdough toast with a little bit of the Kerrygold garlic herb toast and some um, pre-cooked kirkland bacon Anytime I wear this shirt, it reminds me how bad I need to get my tattoo touched up. I need to reach out to Allie and see if she's still in town. But we made it out of the house at uh, 1024, <laughs> waiting for my car to warm up. <laughs> then I'm going to get going. I almost forgot my cheer bag, so I ran back in to get my cheer bag um, so that I can have that for tonight. I'm going to drink my collagen water on the way to work. And my final get out of the house alarm and I made it so good for me I'm gonna drink my collagen water I only drank one coffee this morning <coughs> I do still have a free coffee at the Capital One Cafe so it's cold but today might be the day that I go to the Capital One Cafe and get my coffee I don't know I feel like tomorrow might be the day more because it's super busy but I don't know Okay, I'm gonna get going. I need to put something on my lips. I took all of the lip glosses out of my like, what's it called? My purse? I do have one lipstick. Is this a red lipstick day? Should I do red lipstick, y'all? Okay, let's do it. Let me find it. I know that it's still in this purse. I wish that I had the other one in this purse, but I don't. Okay. You guys, can you balance? Okay, you're balanced. Let's do red lippy stick. I don't wear lipstick very often anymore. Let me draw up. And I used to wear it all the time.
one of the managers at my job wears lipstick like matte lipsticks every day and I can't lie it looks very uncomfortable because <laughs> I remember how matte lipsticks felt like some of them can be weightless but they just feel dry all day because there's obviously matte this is more like a cream matte so it is kind of weightless but I can't imagine wearing that it's not that even guys but I think it'll be okay Okay. Better than nothing, right? All right, let's get my water out of my bag. Probably shouldn't have done this right now because I'm gonna get lipstick all over the straw. It is cold, like 40 degrees right now. I should have on a coat. <clears throat> but I don't. Um, I have one over here. I usually put it on when I get to work and walk out, but I have on my seat warmer and I have on the heat, so. I really love this little car trash can I have. I usually like empty it once a week, but it's so helpful like this little box. I'm gonna put it in my car trash can back here. Um, it fits through the opening at the top and it just goes, around my seat like this it's back here can you see it you can't really see it but it puts like if I stop and get coffee it'll fit the cups if it's all of my tissues that I use um everything so I really like it and then I just empty it usually on Fridays and then it's good for the next week and it keeps my car from being a disaster because historically I have had disastrous cars and I've really had to keep myself from doing it here because I usually tend to leave all of my shoes in the car um but I've been trying not to do that, which means most of my shoes are at work, which is good and bad because if I want to take like pictures of an outfit before work, um, <laughs> more times than not, my shoes that I want to wear are under my desk at work, so I can't really do it before work. So we need to figure something out about that. But all right, um, it is 1028, time to go. Just got home, I have like two ginormous boxes of <laughs> clothes here. But uh, I just got home from cheer. I got out the shower right now. I'm going to put on my skincare. I got like two huge boxes last night of clothes and I tried on some of them, but this one, this is the stuff that didn't fit. I stole this, uh, I can't do it with one arm. I stole this tape gun from my job. <laughs> so I'm gonna go drop this off and then I'm gonna get kava. I'll show you my kava bowl if I remember. So I got this spin drift. I've never, this is like not a good place to film this. Um, I've never had this one before. It is the half tea, half lemon unsweetened. So I'll drink that at work. I'm gonna have all this work, but it is um, not cold. <laughs> it's like kind of lukewarm. So I'm gonna put it over ice. What my bowl looks like, I got tzatziki, um, the little pickles that they have, they're like brine pickles, cucumbers, um, pickled onions, feta, arugula, the saffron rice, some harissa, and I think that's pretty much it. And then I got the hot harissa dressing, but it's on the side. So I will put it on there when I go to work and eat. Looks yummy. Headed over to Torrid, I have a return for there as well. A bra, apparently I don't have big boobs and I thought I did because I ordered a bra for big boobs. Actually it was just a C cup, but I guess I am <coughs> not a C cup, so there's that. And I need to be back to work in like a few minutes, so I can't really browse, I just have to in and out it. Finally they have reduced hours because of COVID. I don't know, COVID was a long time. I mean, it's still happening, but it's kind of crazy. Anyways, I'm gonna have to come back because I do not have time to wait. Good morning. I really like my outfit today. I love this little top. I have on those green Judy Blue. They're like a crop flare different for me but I like them so I have bought that one pair of Judy Blue jeans from the TikTok shop and I really like them they are I feel like I'm in between sizes in them but 
these are 24 those are 24 i like both of them they do stretch out a little bit in between so i do have to like throw them in the dryer because i only wash my jeans like once if you're like five wears <laughs> in between that i'm just like squirting them with water throwing them in the dryer to tighten them up um they're very stretchy like lots of stretch in these jeans all around <laughs> so um you probably could go down a size but the waistband doesn't stretch that much so i probably wouldn't want to i feel like it would be uncomfortable um so i ordered these judy blues are like mid-range anywhere from like 70 to around $70 but these were on sale for $29 in this color and then they had a blue and like a burgundy and I might get them all <laughs> since they're $29 I really like them they're very comfy they look nice at work and then the jeans were very comfy as well so I've always loved cut by the cloth jeans they're pretty expensive like they do an annual sale and that's usually when I grab a couple of pair but these are really great too the Judy Blue if you have been hearing about the hype I think that they're definitely Definitely worth it okay I need to stop my car and I actually have a client meeting this morning we're going to breakfast and I mean obviously I can't show you that because I'll be working but we're going to breakfast and then um I have a short day today so that's nice this is where we're doing our client breakfast at sweet Paris creperie and cafe so cute Round two of trying to go to Torrid and return this bra that does not fit. And I kind of want to see if they have some boots because I have a pair of loafers that I really, really like from Torrid. That was a bit traumatic. <laughs> I do like them a lot, but probably not as much as I just conveyed. They're not that comfortable, but they're very cute. So I want a pair of boots. Here we go success they're open that's so cute oh my god i love it this lighting is weird like it's coming through a tree i did my return at torrid the lady was very grumpy you know when people are like grumpy polite like they have to say thank you have a great day but you can tell they just um sorry my ac is like really loud you can tell they're just like very unhappy to be there and I get it like maybe towards not where you want to be working or you're having a bad day but I just feel like the world's hard right now so I try not to be like hard on people and obviously I don't say anything to them but I just feel like everywhere that I go lately a lot of people that I've encountered whether it be on the phone or like in person are just kind of mean <laughs> like everyone's just kind of mean lately and i don't know maybe it's like uh one of the planets are in retrograde or something i don't know i've just like maybe you guys have had like different um experiences and i really hope you have because it just doesn't feel like great to absorb that kind of energy all of the time like this really like negative energy that i feel like i've been encountering and maybe it's me maybe i'm like uh whatever that word is but i don't think it is like i'm pretty positive and happy so i got these boots some little like they're they look almost white on camera but they're like a light tan maybe there we go that's like the real color they're like a tan chelsea boot and this is like sweater material they were 59 dollars, but all of the clearance was 50% off so they were 30 bucks and then I also those are size 9 and they fit perfectly but I wear a size 10 and then I uh, 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 also got this size 10 Chelsea boot um it's just more of a traditional it does have a zipper on the inside but my foot can slide in which is a requirement because I don't like to have to zip things like to get shoes on there's a pair of flats that i have where i have to like buckle it around my ankle and i just i have an infinity for being barefoot so um when i can't take off shoes like very quickly it annoys me like i'm barefoot even at work most of the time i just like put on shoes when i have to go to the bathroom or something so i like both of these 
Um, those were, uh, how much were these? These were not very much. Those were $30, so they were like $15. They were $30.98, so like about $16, which I thought that was great for two pairs of boots. And then my um, return was like $19 it wasn't a lot because that bra was on sale when I bought it so I ended up paying only $27 out of pocket when I bought this and I thought that was a pretty good deal I am going to run into Kohl's really quick I'm in front of Kohl's in Round Rock because I have $20 in Kohl's cash that I want to use before it expires I should reapply my lipstick huh <laughs> it looks really bad I don't really want to, but I guess I should because it looks crazy. I'm going to reapply it. I If I even brought my lipstick with me, I might have left it on my desk. We'll see. Which my VP, I, I told you guys she was in town this week and when we did our one-on-one -on -one in my office, she's like, you need a new desk. And I was like, I agree. It's too skinny. And she's like, yeah, it's so narrow. How do you fit anything? I was like, I don't fit anything. That's why there's piles all over the place. So, um, I think I'm going to get a standing desk. <laughs> I did order a new chair on TikTok. Um, I was on the fence if I was going to expense that or not, because I think if I ever leave, I might take it with me, but I don't know. We'll see. Might as well expense it, huh? So, ah, here it is. I think I'm going to just expense it. And, uh, since it's for my office, oh, shoot, I'm getting my office repainted and i forgot to ask maintenance if they could do it before i left so maybe they can do it next weekend i'm going to do one gray wall that looks much better right <laughs> that looks so much better um <laughs> I am gonna do one gray wall and one chalkboard wall so my team can leave me little notes on my wall. So that's what I plan on doing. Let me get my Kohl's cash thing. Um, for some reason, one, Carnival called me today with like an exclusive cruise deal. I thought it was a scam at first, then they sent a follow-up email and it was like actually Carnival. Um, but we usually don't, I haven't been cruising Carnival lately. Anyways, um... I don't have great service inside of this Kohl's, so it takes a really long time for things to load. So I'm going to go ahead and take a screenshot so that I can use that. It's already being slow loading so that I can use it at the register. Yep. All right. I'll talk to you guys. In a little bit. I'm actually really hungry. I forgot to eat lunch today because we had that client breakfast and then I wanted to leave early so I just kind of powered through. So I'm a little bit hungry. Alright. I'm gonna go. Well, you can come with me. Tools and Sephora. I don't really need anything from Sephora. I bought so much skincare from TikTok that I'm good on Sephora for like a while. It's Christmas. Already. It's like November 2nd. Maybe it's November 3rd. Yeah, it's November 3rd. I'm in the only kind of club I go to, Sam's Club. Um, I'm just grabbing my smoked salmon that I like here and then just making sure there's not like any other little stuff. I almost got some Premier Protein, but I really like the Fair Life. And for some reason, I can only find the chocolate anywhere. This is my Sam's Club haul. Apples, my salmon, Olay wraps, some turkey and some deodorant. <laughs> That's all I needed. Time to go home. I'm hungry, very hungry. I'm just listening to Kelly Oki. I'm at Popeyes, I'm getting black and tenders. And if I was a recording artist, I would never want Kelly Clarkson to cover one of my songs ever. Like every single song she covers, I'm like, that's better than the original. <laughs> it's so good. Her range is just so good and so powerful. I'm like, gosh, darn, you killed this song. It's amazing. Anyways, I'm going to finish waiting in line and listening to Kelly now because she commands my attention. I'm having breakfast and I finally opened the rest of these like root, <clears throat> root foods, chips. 
these are good I like them they taste like onion but they're sweet because onions are sweet <laughs> um, you know once the natural sugars release and they get caramelized they're sweet same thing with the zucchini for me pretty sweet as well just naturally sweet they don't have any sugar added or anything like that but the star these tomatoes they are so good which you would think tomatoes would be sweet but these still maintain like a good amount of the acidity so I'm just using the tomatoes and some of the onions to like scoop up my cottage cheese but oh my gosh I'm in love with these tomato chips they're so good mmm okie dokie so all of my tiktok shop orders came in I got this trio from the fix this is the fix refresh and recharge cucumber niacinamide cleanser I really like this so far I don't know if it's gonna focus is that focused I can't tell from here <laughs> I don't think it is but the fix um, you can also buy it on their website I think it's just thefix.com this is the fix nourishing skin silk regenerative moisturizer with squalene aloe and hyaluronic acid I also really like this it reminds me a lot of the Tula um, because it just soaks into your skin so quickly the last um, moisturizer I've been using it doesn't really sink into your skin that well so I had to mix it with an oil to get that like quicker absorption but this one's really nice so far and then it also came it was like a little three pack it came with the fix botanical complex vitamin C E and hyaluronic acid vita C primer I thought this was a uh, like a serum but it's a primer so uh, there we go. It looks pretty much it's trying to focus on my pinky, which is quite odd. Okay, there we go So that's what it looks like I'll Show you this one more time just in case it didn't focus. I'll do a touch focus on it. There we go That's what it looks like. So I got this. I also got a chair, but it's for my office like my office um, It's over there. It's a huge box I'll probably show it to you in the next vlog because that's when I'll be taking it to work to like put it together um, and then the WW shop is going out of, it's not going out of business. They're just discontinuing it. They're not going to be carrying products in this capacity anymore. I mean, I have seen them like collaborate with more like influencers lately. They've been doing some like, they're doing a frozen pizza collab. So I feel like they're doing more like store products versus like their own retail. So a lot of their stuff was on a really good sale. I think this was $3.99. This is a chopper. And it's a string chopper, so you just put your veggies in, like, pull a string and it chops it. Great for onions, tomatoes, just, like, quick things you want to chop. And then you can just store it in here, and that would be fine. And then I got two of their little bags because the bags were, like, a dollar. And I always use these. I left my last ones in Mexico because I um, gave some stuff away. So they're just, like, little canvas totes, but they come in great handy, like, if you stop somewhere and you didn't expect to be shopping just to have some canvas totes in your um car is really nice i got this um faberware is it faberware is that how you say it knife set it's just a three-piece knife set i'm actually saving this for when we move but it was a really good price so i just grabbed them same thing with these measuring spoons and cups i got a new scale because i left my last one in mexico this is a food scale left my last one in Mexico so that'll be helpful for when I'm weighing things out and then I also got a body scale as well these are originally $50 they're on sale for $25 like their body analysis scale and then I had a, a, like an additional discount on top of that so it's like $17 for this scale which is a good 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 deal and then um, I grabbed something from Lane Bryant on Halloween. They were having a uh, $13 shipping deal. Not $13. 13 No. Yeah, 13 Or was it 31 31 for Halloween or 13 for Friday the 13th? I can't remember exactly when it was. But anyways, I needed some tights to go under my dresses because it's been going back and forth between like being right now it's warm fall again it's like 70 something degrees it was 40 a few days ago so i ordered a few different pairs of tights to go under 
These are fleece line tights and these are just, um, they're kind of regulars. Oh, they have hearts on them. These are the heart ones. Yeah, cute, oh my gosh. So I got these two and then there's one more pair on the way. These fleece lines ones I'm sure will come in handy a lot. Um, but yeah, that's what, oh. Sorry, my camera died and I dropped it. So that's gonna be the end of today's vlog. I'm getting ready to pack up my bags because the boy and I are doing a little staycation here in Austin on Sunday night. So I gotta get packed for that. I also gotta get my grocery order and all that stuff set. But yeah, I will see you guys next week. I hope you enjoyed this week's vlog. Until next time, remember to keep an open mind, keep an open heart, practice unconditional compassion, but don't take shit from anyone. I love y'all endlessly, and I hope you love yourselves even more. Get out there and love life.